second half. Newark JV versus Caesar Rodney JV. Caesar Rodney is up 28 to 14. Give you a shot on the scoreboard in a second. Just walked in. The varsity game should be very good tonight. Yeah, in case you wanted to see Matthew Channel, Patrick O'Donnell here. That ball goes to Newark. The varsity game, we got uh, Caesar Rodney in Newark. That'll be a good one. The big test for Newark as a down. There's another basket for that. Strong down state team, Cedar Rodney. They lead 30 to 14. New York's gonna, now yeah, they're gonna go to the line, shoot, and walk. There's a score. Stays the same. I believe. Newark is twelve and five. Four boys. And, and they see that Rodney is thirteen, four maybe. Uh, Newark, maybe thirteen and five. They have Caesar Rodney and uh, Dover on Saturday. I'll be up in Pocono. Watch that. Is that on 302? I hope it is. Um, it may not be. So Caesar Rodney JV up by 16 points right here. Mark is uh, going to need stops and baskets. Trying to get back in the game. Ball down low. He should be called for a walk. He called him for, I think, a walk. Four or three seconds. Could be the walk. Steve Rodney has got with uh, three quarter court pressure. Got his own press. Newark breaks it. Goes for the. We're going to get another breakaway. Right there, the defense of Caesar Rodney. And I think timeout start. Caesar Rodney up 32 14 here in the JV game. That's going to be Newark Paul bringing it in. 351 to go. That's more of a full court track. And. Pressure works again. He was really good against Concord, too. Uh, I don't quite remember his name. I think it's 32 to 16, so. 2.50 to go in the third period. It was like they cut it by 10. Cut it to 10 before the quarter, for sure. 2.47 to go, third quarter, 32-16. Newark Trail and CR and JV. So Caesar Rodney ball. Ball is loose, but Newark can't get it. Caesar 
Rodney King, he's fouled, two shots. That's two shots for Caesar Rodney. This is the first. It is uh, great for Newark as they go to extend the lead, which is 16. They make second 33-16. And again, it looks like man-to-man -man pressure, full court man-to-man. But it's not totally overwhelmed Newark. Newark able to break that press. Get the ball down, go underneath. He makes left. Slug two makes left. 38, 33, 18. Good block by Newark with 15. Misses it also. Newark. Hits that, it's a two. It's a two, but it's 33 to 20. Game shaping up. A couple more stops for Newark. They'll be right back in this game. They're going down low. He's banging. Nice play by number one as uh, they tried to. Nice 13. Hits a three. Makes a 16 point lead again. Newark trying to run with CR. That's what they're going to need to do to get back in this game. He's a Rodney. You can see it. They're able to play the D. Makes 38 20. Two, two shots. First shot's no good. Doesn't like Newark. Doesn't look like Newark is going to be able to get back in this JV contest. As, uh, he's a Rodney. His defense seems to be overwhelming. Able to get the steal, make layup. He's strong on the board, number one is. He got, got blocked by number 15. Oh, Cedar Rodney. That's a nice drive. He puts it in by number 40. 38-22. It's gonna be the first couple minutes of that fourth quarter. New York's gonna have to make up uh, six, eight points. So, uh, the ball's loose. You can't get to it. Uh, Ten seconds. Traveling call, so there's he's riding on score. Only 1.4 seconds. If he throws it the length. Now, he's going to get a shot off. It's no good. Off the steal. After three quarters. Ooh, baby. It is, um, see the Roddy JV 38. And Newark JV 22. Newark, got to get to work right away. Cut the lead to film by 16. He's going to drive right away, throw that up. It's short. He's going to go fast break. And they pull it back out. Go to the corner. He's the middle, he's fouled, got the good little two shoots. Two shots. First is up, no good. Good board, Trey. He's Rodney able to get 
get the rebound and control the ball. Ball went off in Newark. And the best goodbye. Rodney. 40 to 22. So down by 14 at halftime. She's Rodney. Wants to keep scoring it on at the foul. 13 to go to line. Two days. Two shots. Leaving. All right, so it's going to be Newark JV ball down by 25. 
Hey folks, make sure you check out the classic I put up. Classic is 2013, you know, the year 2013 quarterfinals, Newark uh, versus Sally. Game features a uh, sophomore, Dante DiCenzo, and a junior, uh, Brian O'Neill. Both have good games against Newark. Newark was really picked to be a sleeper team that year. That's a, that's a foul. Well, no, it is. It's Walker. They picked to be a sleeper team that year in the tournament, and then they ended up getting knocked off by Sally, who eventually lost to Stanford in the quarterfinals. I posted uh, I had some, there's, uh, some highlights of that game as well. Those games are also done with the uh, first camera ever has. So you can see a little black little up there in the corner. That's uh, because it was dropped. But now I <laughs> well, this, that's a double dribble we call it. Uh, I don't know, we'll, we'll look at that. I, I'm too busy talking. <laughs> Well, this game's over. I mean, it's 47-22. I'm telling you, check out the classics up there on St. Matthew County. That's a nice steal. Well, for Newark, it's, it's, it's a feature. Today, Blake, I think his name was. Blake, big man. And also, Xavier Purnell. Had a pretty good game that game. Does not get the follow up. Minute 45. Mm. Hustling. Timeout is given to Caesar Rodney as they get the uh, ball and the timeout. And the lead, 47 22 over North TV.
No, no, you gotta take a shot. Oh, is that good? Four seconds. Two, one. That's the ball game. So final. Final from Newark. It is Caesar Rodney JV, 51, Newark JV, Michael.